Welcome back. The following segment is sponsored by the Rose District Farmers Market. Tuesday afternoons and Saturday mornings are filled with healthy and local eating opportunities at the Rose District Farmers Market in Broken Arrow. And they have non-edible vendors like we'll see this morning. Uh, welcome to our kitchen, Nina Case in a Farm Sweet Farm and Kevin Hall of Elevated Candles. Welcome well, back to the you. show. How are you? I appreciate you having us this morning. Food looks absolutely gorgeous. Well, thank you. And you said everything that you see here is from the farmer's market that, that you is ex see on Saturday. Exactly right, yes. And we're here celebrating um, National Farmer's Market Week this week. So if um, you've never been out to a farmer's market, this would be a good time to come see us um, Tuesday and Saturdays. Every single thing in this recipe is has come from the Rose District Farmer's Market. Market. So we started with a pasture raised chicken. These chickens are just amazing flavor, just wonderful. Mm -hmm. And I took some of our farmer's market butter, garlic and basil and put it under the skin. And as you can see, it's sitting on a bed of vegetables. And the great thing about this recipe is you can interchange the vegetables, the herbs, whatever is available, whatever's in season. Mm -hmm. um, so we um, put an onion inside and then roasted it um, just about 10, 15 minutes at 450. Wow. And then turned it back down just to um, cook, finish it off cooking and um, as you can see it is just beautiful and we can serve it with um, some bread and some um, cheese curds with bacon. How can Yum. you go wrong with bacon? Absolutely. So yeah we're excited to show all of the variety of products in addition to all the amazing um, produce, fruits, vegetables. We have um, you know meat, bread, um, cheese, butter, even the seasoning um, I used on um, the chicken. I used this wonderful orange chipotle mm -hmm. um, seasoning and honey. I spread that on the top too right before I roasted it all from the farmer's market. So you can come, you can grocery shop, and then you, we also have um, non-food vendors. So you can come buy some presents, get ahead on some Christmas shopping. So I brought sure. Kevin with me today. Yeah, Kevin, you said you've been uh, making candles uh, for a couple of years now, full-time for a year. Tell us the story. I love these are made out of uh, recycled wine bottles. Yes, um, well, I started out, uh, wasn't really happy with the scents that I was getting. And I said, I'm going to make candles myself. And instead of using containers, we, my girlfriend and I, we drink a lot of wine and we had all this beautiful glass. And I said, you know, why buy a clear glass jar when you have all these nice colors? So I started out making my own, went to the farmer's market and people liked them. And then uh, I didn't have enough wine bottles. So <laughs> I started calling some restaurants and all the restaurants I called, they didn't recycle. So I said, you know, let's recycle for these restaurants. So now we recycle wine bottles for Tulsa restaurants and... We cut all of them and uh, fill them with soy wax, which is uh, renewable. You know, it's grown by American farmers, so. Mm -hmm. They're very unique them. scents, too. Like I see the tobacco and patchouli. Yeah. Musk and mandarin. Yeah, they're, uh, they're all kind of designed to relieve stress. You know, I said I wanted to, like, escape from the stress of the daily grind, you know. And yeah. So um, we try to, like... Elevate the bar is where the name came from. Elevated candles, we want to like make them as strong as possible. You know, you want a really good strong hot throw with a candle, so. Absolutely. That's important. All right, so you'll be out there Saturday? Yeah, we're there uh, every Saturday. Um, if you can't make it, uh, we have a website, elevatedcandles.com. Yeah. All right, and also the uh, you're going to be handing out paper copies of this recipe, which is also on the Facebook page for Rose District. That's correct. correct. Yeah. All right, well, come on out and see them on Saturday at the Farmer's Market. And here's more information on the Rose District Farmer's Market in Broken Arrow. Tuesdays, 4 to 7. Saturdays, 7 to noon. 418 South Main Street in Broken Arrow. BrokenArrowOK.gov. And again, they are on Facebook as well.